hi guys welcome back to my channel today i have a diy for you um so i'm making this video for people who are beginners in the planner community so on instagram i posted some paper clips that i made and a few people messaged me asking how i did them and if i could show you guys and everything so i just decided to make this video really quick so i this is my second video on how to do paper clips my first video was on how to make these and these are just some paper clips made out of things that you print like pictures that you print so if you want to watch that video go check it out it's still on my channel today i'm going to show you how to make clip paper clips um, made out of things that you actually buy before i show you what you need i'm going to show you the clips i've made just so you could get an idea of what can be done so first this is a huge paper clip that i made um, this is a hair clip like you could put it in your hair but i decided to make it a into a perfect clip because it's so cute and it's a big huge bow and it's gorgeous i got this from michael's and then the little uh, well not little it's a huge paper clip as well the paper clip i got it from hobby lobby and i have all of my paper clips in here well some of them so these right here i did not make these were actually from hobby lobby okay so the ones i did make were these this little bow came in a little set from hobby lobby that i'm going to show you later this is another bow and again i got it from hobby lobby and i just put the paper clip in there and i have a lot of bows because i love bows like any color they're really pretty so this is just a smaller black bow here's another one this is a gold and i used a silver paper clip so then i made these right here and then i have this one and it's like a little shaker so this flower right here look at this rose you guys omg i'm obsessed and this rose i got it from the dollar store not dollar tree but another 99 cent store that it's like close to where i live i just got it there i saw it and i was like that's gonna turn into a paper clip and it did so so gorgeous and then i have another one here this is just like what is this i don't know i got it from hobby lobby this one i made it for halloween i think it was not last year but the year before or yeah the year before it has glitter on it it's just a you know what this was this was one of those um rings that uh, you buy like a Dollar Tree for like kids in a little pack of all of, a bunch of them. I cut the little thing your finger goes through. I cut that little thing and then I just glued it to this paper clip to use it on my planner for Halloween because it's like, it's cool. I like it. Now I'm going to show you the materials that you need to create paper clips like that. So you need paper clips, obviously. I have these right here. You can use any paper clips that you want. I always like using the silvers or um, gold. Just because I think they're a little, they look a little bit fancier. But you can use any paper clips, like colorful ones. Um, even these, like I think I've made some using these little flags. I think I got these from Michaels. I'm not sure. Um, then I have a star and just random ones so you can use those so I'm just gonna put this to the side and I got this thing jar full of paper clips I got it from Hobby Lobby for only $3.25 um, original price I think it was like $12.99 they come like in a bunch of different sizes you can see like they have huge ones here and then they have like smaller ones and then medium sized ones just a bunch of them so i'm going to use some of these you're also going to need the things that you're going to turn into bows which i have some right here i have these these are the ones this ones that i showed you here you can use anything that you want um as long as you're able to like glue a paper clip to it so i have some flowers these are from michael's they are from the two dollar section i think and then i have these right here these are shakers um my niece gave these to me like a really really long time ago i have something from dollar tree i have these 
3D flowers or the next sticker. I also have these right here. These are, what are these? These are stickers, yeah. They have like stuff in it too. I don't know if you can see that, but they have like little things in there. Can you see it? I also have these other stickers. These are like donuts. So I thought they were so cute and they also have like things in it. So they're like shakers too. These are the flowers from where I made this paper clip right here. And this is, as you can see, is just this random, what is it, I don't know. But I just cut off the flower and glued the paper clip and then put a gem on it to hide where I glued the paper clip. So that's what I used. And then this is the other thing. What are these called? I don't know, you guys. So this string right here was attached to this other end right here and it was like super super long I don't know what this was used for or whatever but when I saw this little part right here I was like I want that for my paper clips for to make a paper clip I mean so that's what I did to this one and I'm gonna do that to this one later so you can see how I made it once you have the things that you want to turn into paper clips then you're gonna need gems like this right here I got these from Dollar Tree so you could glue them in the back of your paper clips they could be anything hearts stars circles anything you want there could be stickers I used some stickers these are round and they're colorful so let me show you these are the ones I used for this ones and then I have this little set from Hobby Lobby and it comes with a bunch of little things it has gems it has these little things it has clothes pins like the really small ones I got it for the bows that they had two bows in here I already used one you can use literally anything that you find I also have this right here this is a bow and it used to be a ring but it broke so now I'm gonna turn it into a paper clip let's get started you guys Okay, so I'm gonna start with this little bow right here. It has like rhinestones on it, so it's really, really pretty. Um, so this used to be a ring, it broke, so now I'm gonna turn it into a paper clip. I'm gonna use a silver paper clip just because I want it to match. If I put like a different colored one or a gold one, I don't think it's gonna look as pretty, so I'm just gonna use that. And then I'm gonna use this little gem that I got from Hobby Lobby. It came in this little pack of different little things um just to glue it on top that way it hides like where i glued it and i am gonna use a glue gun because that's what i always use and it works fine so i'll just gonna use that so i just put like a little ball of glue there and now i'm gonna put the paper clip and then more glue on top just so it doesn't like move i'm gonna put the gem on it and I do have my tweezers here because sometimes grabbing stuff with my nails is hard. So I just press it down for a few seconds until the glue dries. Okay, so there it is. A perfect little bow. That's the back and then this is the front. I think it looks really, really pretty. And I love how it has like holographic um, on the rhinestone. So now I'm going to show you how I did this one right here using this so what i did was cut the string first so i cut it all the way down okay now i grabbed a paper clip and i'm going to use a gold one just so it can match i'm going to use this size okay so what i did i just opened like one of these little things and push the paper clip in there so like let's see you see this opening right here okay so I just put it in there okay see now I just turn it all the way around like that see it's in there but it keeps moving around because it's not like secured so that's where the glue one comes in so what I did was just squish this down 
a little bit so it kind of opens and then just put the glue in there and I just press it a little bit so the glue can get stuck to the clip and the little string thing whatever this is and there you go there is a paper clip now you can put it on your planner and it's gonna look really really cute with these little strings hanging out now i'm gonna show you how i made my rose paper clip made out of one of these roses so as you can see it comes with like stuck in a little metal string thing so i just cut it off all the way to the edge like that and grabbed a paper clip i'm gonna use another gold just because i really like gold and for the back i'm just going to use one of these um gems i think i'm going to use the pink one because it kind of matches i'm gonna put some glue on my gem Make sure it's centered, just like the paper clip, like that. And now you have a beautiful paper clip. So I teach you how to make some of my paper clips. Now I'm gonna make some of the new paper clips that I um, that I have here because I really, really wanna use some of these um, princesses ones. Okay, and I don't know if I want to use the hearts or these other stickers. You can always put both of them, like one on one side and then the other one on the other side. But So it could be like a double-sided clip. Um, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to use some silver paper clips for these. I think I'm going to do, let's see. Um, I'm going to do Ariel because she's my favorite princess and there you go a beautiful aerial paper clip and I just noticed how it has a different background color this one's green and then this one's pink <laughs> I didn't notice that So this is how my Disney princesses turned out. I think these are really, really pretty. So now the last ones are these right here. Oh my gosh. I love this one and this one.
and since these are big and the same size I could probably just use one on each side like I did with the princesses um let's see I think I'm gonna do I like this one I love you this many sprinkles <laughs> that's cute and I have glue all over my nails. Oh my god. That's the only thing I hate about um, the glue one. That it leaves like a bunch of residue everywhere. So anyways. I think I'm going to do this one on one side. And then this one on the other side. look how cute this is you guys i love this side omg i love it it's really really cute so that is all you guys i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it helps you um with making your paper clip here are just some of the ones i made i hope you enjoy it and leave me a comment if you are gonna try to make these kinds of paper clips i just think they turn out really really cute i really like all of these thank you so much for watching you guys if you want more diys please let me know in the comments below and please subscribe if you haven't again thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on my next video